Punch. So dapat di minis ang pagresol ng kaso. So that they will be in the best position to explain to you, brokers, appraisers, consultants, professionals in real estate on how to deal with the new department. And I promise you, these people are all tested. They've been there. I was there with them. And I promise you that we can create a wholesome coordination between the public and the private sector. So I might as well introduce the two ladies. The second speaker is a veteran of the Human Settlements Commission. For those who have read my book, she started with this agency and she has reached the pinnacle of her career in the department. She started in the Makati, well, of course, she, she studied in the Lyceum of the Philippines. Alam ba nyo, hindi naman tagayong pinaka magaling at saka atin na yun. Ang mga tagalisiyong magaling din. Nakapigod may magaling din. She was the executive assistant of the first planning commissioner, Cesar Marquez. And she studied in the evening at the School of Urban and Regional Planning where she took her master's in environmental planning. And it took pleasure in training everybody that she was one of my former students. Now, uh, she worked with uh, HSC, HSRC, HAURB. Now, she has been designated uh, as the acting director of the Bureau of Environmental Land Use Urban Planning uh, in the department. Uh, director Nora Diaz. And the third speaker, Tontua ako talaga pag nag-introduce ako ng mga kaibigan ko eh. Yung mga estudyante sa tuwa. One day, I will also introduce all of you, no? The third speaker is the director of the Homeowners Association and Community Development Bureau of the New Department. When she approached me when I was a commissioner, Sir, I'd like to join your office. I said, why do you want to join our office, Papa Lorito? Sir, interesado ako eh. Then she studied law at the University of Santo Tomas. Yung paborito ng mga developer at saka ng mga homeowner. Maraming yung nangangaway. Si Antoni Lorena Rico. So these are the three people whom I have requested to share their function and their vision of the new department. So without much ado, I'd like to call now on Director Angelito Aguila. Thank you. 